Oh god. It's cold and it's noisy and I'm not in focus. Oh yeah! So... <coughs> um, it's officially well into 2017 and that's pretty awesome. Because um, last year was a bit strange. <laughs> yeah, and um, lots of things happen. I'm going to have to show you this. Miscellaneous trolley. So yeah, um, 2016 was like a very strange year for a lot of reasons. Like, there was a lot of like celebrity deaths and everyone was just sad. Battery died. Yeah, like so much happened in the world during 2016. Many of our beloved celebrities died, which is a shame. And then lots of people that we didn't know passed away like friends and loved ones and yeah it's um kind of depressing when you think about it and then there was the last couple of deaths with like Carrie Fisher and that was really sad that hit me hard because I love Star Wars and I think that she was a phenomenal actress in everything that she was in and one of my personal heroes passed away, which is Rick Parfit. I put a picture of him here. Rick Parfit. And yeah, he was um, the rhythm guitarist in the States Quo. And as a nipper, that kind of like watching that band and listening to their music, it just really inspired me. Basically, States Quo and ACDC just inspired me to play music and play guitar because I'd run around like a little weirdo with a tennis racket <laughs> pretending I could play and yeah to hear that he passed away just really hit me hard too because you don't think of your heroes passing away you just think of them being around forever and it was kind of sad and then yeah it got to 31st of December and I was in York with my girlfriend and we just had like an amazing time together and like we had two of our friends over which is Hannah and James they're great people and we had a fun night we played Cards Against Humanity and we just had a really good laugh and yeah it was like a really nice night and I didn't record any of it because I just wanted to chill out and spend time with like my girlfriend and her friends, my new friends and it was peaceful and then like for resolutions wise I decided that I'm gonna kind of do one of these a week granted I have missed a week because it's been like It was raining a lot around my area and um, every time I turned on the camera it just felt like I didn't know what to say. So, finished work today, finished work today and um, remember to have my camera in my bag so I thought right, I'm going to do it, I'm going to get on it, there's going to be one a week and there's going to be a new project that I want to start. Um, I'm going to do like a test video of that tonight and hopefully that turns out well, if it does I will post it on YouTube on a different account because it's going to be something completely different to what this is and if it goes well I will explain what it is and all that jab. I want to say it's really cold as well like it's something degrees yeah yeah I think it's 2017 Make sure I'm in focus. Yeah, 2017 is going to be an awesome year. Mainly because I have a girlfriend that I adore. I'm going to see Richard and Katie and Stevie. Um, 
in two weeks time yeah two weeks time and we're gonna have like a gaming weekend and i'll get that on a vlog just because i've missed doing that a lot and rich i probably know that you're watching and i miss you dude what else and i've um, got lots of plans gonna start snowboarding going to going to go on holiday with my girlfriend we've got the plans for that we're going to go to La Paris and see the Eiffel Tower I don't know why I'm speaking in French <laughs> um, yeah it's just like I've got and I'm gonna be doing my driving tests again after the failed attempt I can feel it's gonna be an awesome year and I like that feeling a lot because who doesn't want to feel like it's going to be an awesome year so anyone watching this if there's anything you want to do this year write it down or plan it out in your head I'm going to do it like it's strange to think that this life is a very short life I'm 27 that's a weird thought um, I was looking at different online courses at the Open University and I thought right if I do one part time I'll be finished in six years and I thought fuck six years time I'm gonna be like 33 how scary is that thought do as much as you can in the time that you got because you never know when it could be your last day which is a kind of a bum note to go out on. I don't know if I'm in focus. Boop. Let's end on a happy note. Yeah, do what you can in 2017. Make it amazing. And I'll catch you guys next time.